The project today, of course, is the national tribute to the commemoration of Armistice 100 years ago. And this is a culmination of the community coming together with the Heritage Lottery funding to put together a bid to create a legacy for the Accrington Pals. And this new town square gives that back to community, representing what happened 100 years ago, but actually it gives a future to the borough and this town square to be a social hub. And this year's particularly special with it being 100 years to the end of World War I. I think from 2014, that's when we noticed the biggest increase in people. And again in 2016, so I expect there'll be a lot of people about today. Later today, there'll be the National Remembrance up at the War Memorial. I'm really looking forward to today. There's going to be a lot of activity in the town hall, as well as all the commemorative activity that's going on as well. The parade will swing by onto Church Street, where we'll unveil two benches, which have been specially commissioned. One's been commissioned by the Royal British Legion and the other one by the Accrington Pals Centenary Commemorative Fund. And then later we have a play read by Julie Esmanos and other actors locally. We have a local school playing so their jazz music in there, um, as well as all the commemorative activity that's going on as well. And then we go to the National Tribute, which is of course the beacons, the pealing of the bells. And then we have a fabulous 3D projection onto the facade of the Market Hall. It's clean, it's modern, it looks nice. There's lots of things of interest with the benches and the sculptures. We've done our pals a great tribute and I think the town will show its appreciation for what their sacrifice gave to us all.